In this lecture, we will be discussing about the difference of two ascending order linked list. I suggest for uh, understanding the difference of two ascending order linked list, you should go through the uh, lectures on as a creation of the ascending order linked list, union and intersection of the ascending order linked list. So, in this uh, process of finding out the ascend difference of two ascending order linked list, if I am interested in finding out A difference B, then the answer will be all those elements which are there in A but not in B. For example, if these are the two linked lists, you can see that the element 10 and 20 are present in B and A both. So 10 and 20 are not going to be the part of A difference B. Every other element of A set will actually become the a difference B. For example, we are not going to add 10 and 20. Rest of the elements, for example, 10, uh, 30, 40, and 50, these will be the part of A difference B. Similarly, if we are interested in finding out the B difference A, so all the elements which are there in B but not in A, again, the common elements in B and A are 10 and 20. So, every other element than 10 and 20 will be the B difference A. For example, in this case, 5, 15, 25, 27, and 29. So, these are the answers of A difference B and B difference A. How to find out with the help of the program? We already uh, have designed a program for A union B. So we will consider the A union B as a base for finding out the A difference B. This is the A union B wherein we have compared the elements of both the linked list and this loop will be comparing the elements once the completion is not once the comparison is not possible between the nodes of the linked list we will come out of this loop and every element which is uh, remaining in the first linked list will be added in the final linked list one by one similarly every element which are there uh, which are remaining in the second linked list will be added one by one but either of these two loops will run at a time if you are interested in finding out a difference b then the second loop will not run because if we have added every remaining element of A, then no requirement of adding the elements of the second linked list because in the A difference B, every element which are common in A and B, they will not be the part of A difference B. The rest of the elements in A linked list will be the part of A difference B. So no question of adding the elements of second linked list. Other than this, if we are finding the elements, are uh, let's say we are comparing the elements of A set and B set. Suppose A, is a set is re represented by the linked list and B set is also represented by the linked list. Then if you are making the comparison between the elements of first set and second set and elements are equal, then obviously that will they will not be the part of A difference B. So if the elements are common, move B one step ahead and similarly move Q one step ahead. If the elements are not common and the information content of P is less than information content of Q, it means the information of the node in the first linked list is less than the information in the node of the second linked list, then first linked list node will be added in the final linked list. But if the second linked list node is smaller than the first one, that will not be added in the final linked list. So we will remove this. We are just incrementing the pointer to go to the next location, but we are not adding that element in the final linked list. So only those elements are added, which are the part of the first linked list, and those elements are not common to the second linked list. So we have created the ascending order linked list. 
with 10, 20, 30, 40, and 50. Another one, 5, 15, 25, 27, 5, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 27, and 29. And then we have traversed the link list first and link list second. And then we are finding out the A difference B. You can see that 30, 40, 50 are the part of A difference B. Similarly, we can find out B difference A. Just copy and paste. Let's say the name of the function is B difference A. Let's copy this function of A difference B and let's make it B difference A. The changes here will be if the elements are common, no matter of adding that to the final link list. But if element of first link list is smaller, that will not be added in the final link list. But if the element of the second link list is common that will be added in the final link list. So by the time the comparisons are possible, we will be comparing the information of P and Q. If they are equal, they will not be added, but we will be moving P and Q both. If the information content of P is smaller than Q, that will not be added in the final link list, but P will be incremented to point to the next location. If the information of the second link list is smaller, then that will be added in the final link list. And uh, when the comparison is not possible, either of the link list has ended up. In that case, every element which are remaining in the second link list will be added in the final link list one by one. So while Q is not equal to null, insert and Q dot info and Q equals to Q dot next. So we can check if that's working fine. You can see that the B difference is 5, 15, 25, 27, and 